I'm indeed honoured and grateful to be able to participate in a small way in this project of remembrance and reflection, which has been undertaken by Angus Horden and Alex Lloyd in respect of the service of 11 old boys of the school, a small sample of a great number who gave service in World War II. The project started from a discussion I had with Angus at an Anzac memorial service at Knox in 2010. I told Angus that 11 of 60 of my year of 39 had been killed in World War II, the biggest loss of any year. I told him that it had been my purpose over the years to honour those men in particular, and indeed all old boys listed on the Quadrangle Memorial. From this conversation, Angus and Alex have done all that they have done as an act of love and respect for all those who served and for which I greatly honour them. In 2010, Thistle Productions began their journey. Their task was to chronicle the service of 12 Knox Old Boys who fought in World War II. Angus Horden and Alex Lloyd teamed up for this undertaking. The first footage was shot at a Tobruk Remembrance Service, commemorating 70 years since the Rats of Tobruk were victorious over the Germans. Can we admire? <laughs> That afternoon, in April 2011, the first interview took place with Ted Carter. The 12th veteran, Richard Miles, was interviewed in February 2013. By this stage, Knox Old Boys Thomas Kay and Rohan Viswalingam had joined the core team. The interviews continued throughout 2013 and 2014. Participants included notable historians, Dr. Brendan Nelson, Mr. John Weeks, and other important figures in the Knox community. There have been so many people, Knox staff, Knox old boys, current Knox students, and otherwise, who have given their skills and expertise to this project. We give special thanks to all of them. For school and country exists because of these people, giving the tribute our brave ex-servicemen deserve. For school and country began as a passion project to record the stories of some fellow old boys who had served. It became an intimate, heartfelt drive to honour and commemorate these men and all others who served. We remember all of our great veterans, especially those no longer with us today. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Okay, one, two, three. Arthur? Okay, we'll count to three. 